people i'm back with another video and today i'm super excited because i'm going to be unboxing my second super scoop from Enel couture in case you all don't know i do have a whole dedicated playlist unboxing all of the scoops that i've gotten from Enel couture i've gotten multiple of the single 20 dollars scoops um I, i've bought them different um quantities at a time i bought four at a time two at a time one at a time etc and then I ventured out and got that uh, super scoop once he put it on his website. So if you all missed that original unboxing, I'll leave that down in the description box below as well. But that was an amazing super scoop. Um, so much so that it made me want to go back and get another one. And this time I decided to pop in a, a color scoop as well. And so this scoop you all already kind of saw like a preview to because um, they boxed my color scoop and my super scoop together in one box. Um, so if you missed my color scoop unboxing, which was also really amazing, um, I I'm going to leave that link down in the description box at, uh, below as well. But um, as you all can see from the order that I got, it was one color scoop, one super scoop. So the color scoop is already up. And if you guys want to see that, I'll link it. But now let's get into my second super scoop. And yeah, I'm excited. Okay. This here is the box that it came in. Again, it's already open because it came with my color scoop. But I, I, but I haven't actually taken a peek inside. I don't know what's in here. So I'm hoping it is just as good as my original super scoop because I got a lot of Cool items in there so let's just do a quick sneak peek y'all we're gonna do a quick sneak peek y'all just to see so I think they had my color scoop separated by this little piece of paper here so I'm gonna move this out the way and yeah we're gonna take a quick little look see ooh, looks like we got some really nice goodies in here oh okay I was wanting that okay 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 all right, I'm gonna put this off to the side and we'll hop right on into it, okay? I'm excited because I see some items in this scoop that I was wanting. So yeah, y'all, let's hop into it. So the first thing that I saw right on top was um, the Enel Couture apron. I have a few of these and I really love them a lot. Um, I have them in my nail room. I have them downstairs in the kitchen for when I'm cooking. I have it in my travel nail tech kit so that when I'm traveling doing other people's nails. And somebody mentioned this on their channel. I can't remember who it was, but it was such a genius idea. And they were like, if you have little kids, you can use these for when they're doing painting and playing around with water and things like that so I'm just really happy because the rest of my um, aprons that I have I'm gonna be giving them to my daughter so that she can stop making these big old messes here in the house so whenever I'm doing painting with her watercolors playing around with just stuff that's really messy and I don't want to mess up my carpet I can use this apron so I'm excited that I found a third fourth use for it so yeah this is gonna be my daughter's apron to keep the place tidy and clean <laughs> So the next thing I see here are a couple of nail tips. Um, let's see. I don't know why I was expecting it to be more in here, but it's not. So let's see here. So let's look at the nail tips that I got. I absolutely love his nail tips. If you all have not seen um, some of my tutorials, I've done some dedicated tutorials showing you guys how to apply his nail tips using um, the nail tips along with the one, two, three, go bubblegum gel. I have, I think two or three tutorials on my channel with that. Um, so I will leave that um, down in the description box below as well. But his products are absolutely amazing and super easy to work with. Um, so the first one I have here is Princess Pink Coffin. Um, so these are really cute. Um, again, I just love his nail tips. They're amazing. Um, we have here Taper Coffin, which I really love the Taper for coffin ones um i think these are like the extra extra long coffin nails which today y'all i'm sporting my extra extra long nails all right it's the weekend so i'm letting my baddies out tonight <laughs> um let's see here let me grab a number let's grab a number five and i just want to see how long it is compared to the nail tips that i have on because i'm wearing some pretty long nails this uh today oh my god i love these nails i got these in my last super scoop and i really love them because it's the apex for me you guys look at how nice and sculpted this nail tip is it's absolutely gorgeous like oh my gosh and yeah as you all can see it is about the same length nope it's actually longer so are these triple x y'all because i know i have on extra extra long nails right now so these must be triple x nails but i love how nice and slim they are these are some really nice nail tips very strong and sturdy so i can't wait to use these real nice sharp c curve there real pretty okay so i have these very nice and I like that he's putting more clear nail tips in the bags. Um, gives people more options of how they want to design their uh, nail tips. So we got these. 
Next, I have the Eternal Beige Almond. Y'all, I absolutely love the way the Eternal Beige nails look on me. They're absolutely gorgeous, so happy to have more of these. And then last but not least, we have a Sculpt Shirt Almond Medium, which I also got in my last scoop. Um, and I love a good almond shaped nail, stiletto shaped nail, so really happy to have these. These Sculpt Shirt nails, I really love the apex and the structure on them. They're really, really nice. So happy to have these. So I got four packs of nail tips. Next here, I got some nail foils. Uh, this time around, I got three boxes of nail foils. Looks like I got two of the same design here. And these are really pretty. They're like um, animal print, like hollow themed animal print nails. So those are really cute. And then over here, I got some... Actually, I don't think I have these ones here. Yeah, I actually don't have these. So I got some new foils. That's pretty awesome. I have some similar to these, but not the exact ones. So these are like hollow snake skin. Oh, this is pretty. I've not seen this one before. Oh, this one's like a cheetah print with some flowers on it. Yeah, I don't have these. These are nice. These are really pretty. This one just, I don't know what this is, but it's really pretty. I love this hollow yellow flower. These, yeah, these are cool. I don't have any of these. Very nice. Got the snake skin hollow. Very cute. I can see myself using these for sure. Okay. So we got these. Again, three boxes of foils. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Okay, so next I got me some square poppers. So if you guys aren't familiar with what poppers are, they are essentially dual forms. And I'm happy that I have the square shape because y'all know, as y'all can see, I love me a good square nail. Long, short, or medium, I love me a good square nail. So I'm going to go in with zero. Hopefully this is zero. Oh no, this is one. But look at that. This is a really nice structure on this. First off, C-curve is absolutely beautiful. I love the length on it. It's just ever so slightly longer than the nails that I have on. That's really nice. So I'm going to have fun trying to scope my nails out with these. I did get some of his Happy Gel and some of my previous scoops. And so I'm excited to just play around. Um, I've been wanting to get back into Poly Gel. I, I forget. I think I was watch, watching Netka Nails. And she does some really beautiful Poly Gel nails. And she just had me motivated to kind of get back into doing some Poly Gel. So I actually recently got some um, dual forms from... Um, Timu and it came with a lot of different sizes and shapes and lengths and things like that so um, I'm happy to have some square ones as well um, to kind of play around with but yeah these are really nice these are really nice and I love with these particular dual forms too that they're straight I think some of the old school dual forms had a weird curve to them so I can definitely see myself getting use out of these for sure next I got me some more Lux wipes um, you guys have seen these in pretty much every scoop I got a lot of boxes of these and these are really good for cleaning off your acrylic brushes so happy to have some more of these it comes with 50 oh wow oh my gosh <sighs> Y'all, I got some good stuff in this scoop. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Okay, I don't even know where to start. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. Okay, so I did get another file. This one is 240, 240, and then I got some orange sticks. I absolutely love his orange sticks. So I'm gonna put these away right now. I just keep his orange sticks and his files in here. So I'm just gonna pop this in here along with these right here. And then also too, I took out my little tin thingy the little shelf that was in here. I want to show you guys how I'm using it. I actually use this to store all of my um, magnets for my cat eye gels. Um, I've, I saw this idea on somebody else's channel. Again, I forget who it was, but I thought it was a really cool idea to be able to just put your magnets on here and then they're nice and organized because otherwise they were all clumped together and stored every which way. So happy to have these. So whenever you're ready to go do your cat eye designs, you can just kind of have this. I tried leaving it in here, but I noticed that when I closed it, this got stuck to the lid. So um, I just keep it out in another drawer. But yeah, really nice and handy if you guys are looking for a way to store this. But And then I also put my nail files in here. So that's how I'm using this. Speaking of the candy boxes, I did get another one of these. Um, you can never have too much storage, so happy to have another one. I've actually been using these in my daughter's room to store all of her markers, crayons, color pencils, etc. I got her this dry erase board and I got like a, a ton of colorful markers or dry erase markers that she uses to draw on it with. Put that in there too, so these are really great for storage. So I got this. He included another um, 
ombre puffy um, which is really nice you can never have too many of these so I'm happy to have this play around with my ombre a little bit more yes I got another one of these brushes you guys I'm not gonna lie I really enjoy these brushes a lot when I say I've been reaching for this brush all the time now when I do my nails the one thing I enjoy about it is not only can you get underneath the nails like this but this right here is the key to this one where you can get real good up underneath the nail and really good under the nails to get that dirt and debris from under there I really really love that so um, I'm gonna go ahead and put one of these in my bathroom um, and this one here is gonna stay in my nail room yes I got here another photo album which is really awesome I do have a lot of nail stickers you guys so this is my second album that I got I'm happy to have another one of these I'm gonna be storing a lot of stickers in here okay so I got this right here which I believe is super glue you guys I'm not gonna lie his super glue is actually really good in my last scoop I got like a little tiny thing of super glue I've been having that in my purse this has been working out wonderfully so I have no doubt in my mind that this nail glue is gonna be that this nail glue is gonna be really good as well and I like that this one has a brush on it so I'm definitely gonna keep this here in the nail room a nice and handy can never have too many nail glues here I got some bling which is really cute so this here So this here is what this bling looks like. It's really nice. Comes with like some um, gold embellishments, caviar beads. I like these really big golden rhinestones. That's really pretty. Kind of like champagne colored. So gorgeous, big pearls. Oh, look at this one. How cute is that? That's like a, a charm that has like some bling and a pearl on it. Really beautiful, got a couple gold bars. Oh yeah, that's gorgeous. Really cute. Happy to have this. Ooh, I did get some more Easy Ombre Powder. I got this in my last scoop as well. I'm assuming that this is like um, either a clear or maybe a milky white color. Um, so this is what it looks like here. I'm going to have to get this swatched out. Um, I wanted to wait to unbox my second Super Scoop so that I can do all of the gels and acrylics that I got in one swatch video. So after this video, I'll be swatching out everything that I got. But that is what that looks like. Very nice. And I love these new jars that he has. These are really nice. Seems like it's a metal lid. It's just a really cute design for his jar. So I'm glad he upgraded them. They look really nice and cute. The next couple of items I got here are some stickers. I don't have these particular stickers. They're really cute. They're kind of like this um, orangey color with some nice gold in it. Really cute. I like the design on these. And then these here are some more. They got some hearts, more roses, kind of French tip roses. I don't think I've seen too many people with these. So these are cute. So got some stickers. Next, I got some more silicone tools. Happy to have some more of these. I did get these in my last Super Scoop as well, but you can never have too many, so I got these. Did get some more brushes, you guys, which I'm super excited about. So I'm gonna start off with these brushes here. Let me get them open. Oh, it's a gel brush, nice, okay. I feel like, I thought it was just an acrylic brush. Okay, y'all, I'm a little nervous, though, because I've been seeing people whose brushes have been leaking. Um, I'm afraid to even play around with this thing because it does look like some of the juice is already uh, leaked out of it. But I don't see any leaking on my hands. Yeah, I see slight leaking here. So let me show you guys the other brush that I got in my kit. So this is the brush that I got in my last Super Scoop. You all see how it's full and there's no leakage or anything like that um, so I guess these are some older brushes that he had um, they're still really pretty they still well they don't really flow like they're supposed to but i um, happy to have them still so this one here is oh uh, it got oil on it okay hmm a little bit of leakage there I think you can still get use out of them though what I'll likely do is I'm probably just gonna go ahead and take this bottom part out and drain it out and empty it just so I don't have to worry about any type of spillage I mean this stuff in here it's cute but you know I'd rather be able to use the brushes themselves but I got an acrylic brush and I got a number 12 which is awesome the last brush that I got in my kit uh, was a number 16 I got here a nice gel brush which is so cool happy to have this as well that's perfect um, 
yeah that's awesome so happy to have these two again like i said off camera i'm gonna go ahead and drain the liquid out of there so i don't have to worry about any spillage or anything like that but happy to have these two i like that he, he included a variety of different brushes in this particular scoop so i got these two brushes i'm going to put them back in here like so and then i got these two brushes okay so let's see what these are I think this might be the ombre brush. I, that's what I saw people getting in their scoops. This is really cute. I like that it has a lid, and yes, it is. Here's the ombre brush here. Oh, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. This mug looks like it's used. Hold on now. <laughs> is it just me, or does it look like that bad boy been used? Oh, uh, all right. Well, you know. And it's hard too. That's interesting. Okay, maybe it's I don't know. It kind of looked like it's been used. Y'all, y'all tell me. Y'all be the judge of it. But I got an ombre brush, which is nice. I'm gonna put the lid back on here. Mommy, yes, you are. Any who? You want bread? bread. Oh, why are you making a big mess? No, I eat it. No, you're not. You're not gonna eat all that. Yeah, my daughter and her making a huge mess. Oh my gosh. That's okay. Let me just finish this video. Okay. And then let's see what we got in here. Ooh, this one's hard to get off. Okay. And this here is another ombre brush. Huh, I wonder if the lid caused it to get smudged. I'm not sure, but got two of these. Can never have enough nail art brushes. So happy to have this. Next we have this here, which is I believe another little mini flash cure light. Yes. Okay. So I do have two of these. So likely I'll be giving one of these away so this is really cute um and yeah really nice to have when you're doing gel x nails and when you're applying his one two three go system i'm really excited because i got some more of these nail brush wipes y'all these right here are bomb.com if y'all like them lux wipes y'all are going to love these i opened these up in my last video and they are just so soft and so luxe and they are big and so yeah i'm really happy to have these i'm going to be getting a lot of use of these I'm going, to getting, I'm going to be getting a lot of use out of these here in my nail room. I got these. I also got some more of his wet wipes. Apparently these can be used for um, nails and makeup. I'm going to be using them for, for nails. I don't think I want to try putting these on my face. So, got these. Looks like I got another dappin' dish. Again, you guys, these are all staples you can never have too much of. This is so cute. I'm not gonna take this out of the box cause I already have mine's open over here. I've been getting some good use out of it, but this is what it looks like. It's really cute, has nice grooves in it. You know, you can use it for acrylic, you can use it for alcohol, you can use it for acetone, monomer, etc. Um, so yeah, actually, I might keep clear acrylic in one and maybe like monomer in the other one. It might be a good use for these. So yeah, I got these. Next, I got some of these nail remover wipes. I actually did not get this in my last scoop. Um, so let's open this up and see what it's looking like. Okay, so this is a box of wipes. I thought these were pretty cool because it looks like, um, yeah, okay, that's what I thought it was. So they are vegan, hypoallergenic, and hema-free, which is always nice with nail products. But the cool thing I like about this is, you see this little tab right here? I think this is for when you want to soak your nails off. You just tear a piece here and then put, put your nail inside of it. And I think this might be some tape or adhesive to be able to wrap it around your nails so that you don't have to like do the cotton ball soak off. Um, so I kind of like that he has it kind of all in one. So I'll be interested to use these when I soak off. One of my next set of nails so got these and it comes with a hundred of them so you get plenty next here you guys i got me another nail rest omg i am really excited to have another one of these um so now i don't feel guilty about keeping one in my travel nail kit because now i can have one here at, in my nail room here at the house and then also now when i'm on the go doing other people's nails i just absolutely love this um i got this in my last super scoop too i'm very very happy to have this um i did see that in some of the more recent super scoops people are getting like practice hands and things like that i'm gonna be honest with you guys i'd much prefer to have a nail rest an armrest something like this because i feel like i can get a little bit more use out of it um so yeah i'm happy to have this i did also get another cup you guys okay okay we got it in the color i'm not the biggest fan of okay well, i'll be honest so this time it came in the color green Ooh. <laughs> i'll be 
be honest, y'all. I'm not the biggest fan of this uh, color here. Um, I really like my old one, though. Let me show you guys. So, so, oops. so this is the one that I got in my last Super Scoop. And I must say, I really, really love the color of this one. Mainly because it matches the decor here in my nail room. So, I actually have this one out on display. So, I actually have this one out on display in my nail room. This green one, I'm not the biggest fan of. And so... Um, like I promised, I'm going to probably go ahead and give this to my daughter so that she can use it. Um, but what I love about it is at the top here, it says good mood and it's like a little snow globe. I'm going to give it to her now. Let me see what she thinks about it. Yara, come here. Yara, come. What do you think about this? What do you think? Here, come. You like it? Yeah. You like this? I want to try it. You want to try it? Yeah. Here, come. Uh, this your new cup. You want to hold it? No. Yeah. You like it? No. Yeah. That's yours. What's this right here? Uh -huh. what's, uh -huh. what's this right here? A um, rainbow. A rainbow. Good job. What are the colors of the rainbow? It is all the colors of the rainbow. And what's this right here? Hi. It is a heart. What else we see in here? Uh, a star. It is stars. Good job. Mommy. Yeah. Do you like it, baby? Yeah. Okay, awesome. All right, y'all. So she got her I new cup. Huh? Oh, you said all right, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm your baby. You are my baby. Oh, my gosh. I have a mama. You have a mama? Who's your mama? Is it me? Yeah. It is. Mwah. All right, say bye. Bye. All right, y'all. So this is going to be her cup. So next here we have some pink bubblegum gel. Super excited to have some more of this, you guys. This stuff is so good. Again, I do have a dedicated video showing you guys how to apply the 123 Go Nails with this pink bubblegum gel. So I'm going to leave that link down in the description box below. But yeah, I love this stuff. Yes, baby. Mommy, then go party. Go party. Go ahead. Next here, I got a couple of potted gels. So these are autumn candy. I'm excited to have some of these. I've been seeing everybody get these in their scoops as well. And yeah, it's just some potted gel. I think they're potted glitter gels, okay? So this one here is autumn 04 and autumn 03. I'm gonna go ahead and open these up really quick. Oh, wow. Wow. These are pretty intricate glitters here a lot going on there very very pretty so i'll get these swatched out here in the in the next video but it has it's an orange glitter that has butterflies and hexagons and fine glitters it's pretty different i don't think i have anything like that so i got this so again this is autumn candy 04 and this is 8 ml worth of product these little containers are kind of cute though i like that Next color we have here is Autumn Candy 03. Let's go ahead and get this open. Ooh, this is pretty. This is giving me Easter vibes, honestly. This is really cute. So this again has butterflies. It has um, like different type of pastel glitters. You got the pastel pink, orange, blues, greens. Really fun, fun glitter there okay so we got these it's different I don't have any products like this Mommy, yes this, I bite my finger you bite your finger yeah I'm sorry baby Did, is the water on okay it so hurts okay y'all go sit down for a second baby go sit down it's okay uh, this right here gives you guys you don't need a doctor. Go sit down. Okay, now this here kind of shows you a little bit what the glitter looks like. I just wiped off uh, my little cuticle stick here, but it's really pretty. It's a lot of different types of glitters in there. Um, next here, I got four more of these, and this is their winter collection, which is really cool. So let's take a closer look at these. Okay. Looks like I got winter candy one two three and four awesome sauce so let's take a closer look at each one of these so this one here is winter candy zero one oh 
pretty. This is really pretty. So this one has hearts and stars and butterflies. It's kind of pink themed. Uh, this is actually giving more Valentine's Day vibes than winter vibes, but it is super cute. Um, looks like it's a loose viscosity of a gel too. Yeah, I'm excited to get these swashed out and see what they look like. So got this. Next we got the Winter Candy 02. This one here looks like a nude color. It's a nude that has like different butterflies and glitters and hexagons in it. Okay, so we got this. Next we have Winter Candy 03. Oh, okay. Oh, I don't know what to make of this. It's like a deep brown color. Same glitters in it, like hollow iridescent glitters that have butterflies and hexagons in it. This one kind of looks a little mucky, so we'll see what that looks like swashed out, okay? And then the last one we have here is the Winter Candy 04. Oh, how pretty. Oh, I like this one. This is really gorgeous. I like this color a lot. So it's a white base glitter that has like just different hexagons and I think it has hearts in it. This is really pretty. This is this definitely reminds me of winter time. So that one's very, very fitting. So that's super cute. So we got this. Yeah, so that's pretty cool. I got um I got six of his um I guess the the potted gel glitters. Um, I wasn't expecting to get that, so that's pretty cool. Um, so I'm excited to have these. We'll get these swatched out here in my next video. So I got six of these beautiful colors. Next, I got some more gel polishes, which is really awesome. I really, really, really enjoy his gel polishes a lot. So let's see what colors I got here. Yeah, I pretty much have like so many of his gel polishes now. It's not even funny. Um, it's so funny when I started these scoops I started them for the nail tips and then I ended up having like a lot of his gel polishes so that's pretty cool um, so let's take a look here and see what I got okay okay so I got six, was it six or five? Okay, so I got five of his gel polishes some of these colors look like colors I do already have but let's take a closer gander here so the first gel polish I got, these are 15 ml full size bottles, is 149. I do think I have this one already. Ooh, it's a really beautiful purple glitter color, absolutely gorgeous. Next I have 148, which is this really beautiful gold, it kind of looks like a gold chrome. I definitely know I have this one, so this one will probably be put in a giveaway. And in case you guys don't know, I actually do silent giveaways on my channel. So if you're active on my channel, commenting, um, showing me love, showing me support on a regular basis, you could be chosen as the winner of a giveaway. I don't announce the giveaways on my channel anymore. Just it's been a lot of stuff with that. So now I just um, select those who um, I'd like to be able to give uh, nail products to. And so definitely make sure you guys are staying tuned to the channel, staying active, showing love, showing support, and you could be chosen as the winner of one of my silent giveaways. Okay. So yeah, this here is a really beautiful gel polish here. Next color we have here is 133. Ooh, this is a really beautiful rose gold. I know I don't have this color. This is gorgeous. It's really pretty. Next here I have 096. Ooh, this rear is a this here is a really beautiful nude color. It's kind of like a a light peachy nude. Very, very pretty. I love when I get some nudes these days, y'all. I'm, I'm loving that. That's a really pretty color. Honestly, these two colors look like they go very, very beautiful together. Well, not really. That's oh, cute though. And then last but not least, it looks like this bottle is a little bit different. It's 136. I guess, oops. I guess this is his old packaging and so when he upgraded it, this is what it looked like. I do like this one better. Um, but yeah, it's 136. Okay, and this is a really beautiful jelly glitter pink color. Very, very nice. Alrighty, so those are the gel polishes that I got. Alrighty, so I did get another gel liner, which is super exciting. Um, this is the Super Rich One Coat Gel, and this here looks like it's a nice bright neon pink color. Let's see. Ooh, and it is. 
again this the timing of these are so perfect because this would be great for some Easter designs or some spring designs summer designs absolutely gorgeous i also got a galaxy kitty collection you guys i was so excited in my color scoop i got six of these colors i don't know if i have zero one two but i absolutely do love the packaging on this it's really cute i love that silver ombre up until the gold at the tip i mean just gorgeous these are full size bottles and they're 5d cat eye gels okay so let's see what these look like Ooh, yes, very, very beautiful. I think I do have this color, but if I don't, oh, I can't wait to play around with it, y'all. This is so cute. This gives like snake vibes. Very, very beautiful. And last but definitely not least, I'm super excited. I have this. I think this is one of his top coats, you guys. Not gonna lie, I've been wanting to try his Wonder Gel top coat for like the longest, longest or was it shiny top coat? I don't know. But his top coats look really cool, so I'm happy to have one of them. And this is in 001. Again, I'm one of those who are not the biggest fan of the packaging with the long stems on it. But, I mean, the bottle's cute. Um, I'm just not a fan of it for storage reasons. But I'm excited to see what this top coat looks like, you guys. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I got a top coat. Okay. Ooh, how pretty. So, it's a really beautiful glitter top coat. Oh, I love it. Love, love, love it. That's gonna be fun to put on top of some nails. Like, even on, on top of a set like this, where I have like just a regular French tip, this could be really cute on top of. Oh, look at that. Look at me, I just wanna play around with it right now. Look at that. How cute is that? Take any little nail design and elevate it, bring it to the next level. That's absolutely gorgeous, you guys. I love it. Love, love, love it. Okay. So yeah, y'all, these are all of the polishes that I got. I got quite a few gels in this Super Scoop, which I was pretty happy about. I got a top coat, I got a cat eye, I got all of these gel polishes. I got a liner, and then I also got all of these cool um, potted glitters. Um, so I thought it was really cool that he included more variety in the types of gels that were included in the Super Scoops. So I'm gonna bring everything up here, give you guys my final thoughts. Alrighty, so this is everything that I got in my most recent super scoop this is super scoop number two for me and i'm very pleased with everything that i received i did get this during the lunar year sale so it was 60 bucks i think that the super scoops have since went up i think they're like six dollars more now um but i think he still does discount codes and things like that for the super scoops um i'm happy with everything i got i'm really impressed with the amount of gels that i got in this particular super scoop i got a total of 15 different gel products um between the regular gel polishes the cat eye the top coat the liner the potted gels with glitters as well as the bubblegum gel so i thought it was great that he included more gel products i love all the essentials that i got um i'm, be, I'm gonna put all this stuff to use the nail brushes the nail art tools the um the photo book the armrest the dappin dish i mean all of these items i know i'll get plenty of use out of i also like that he included some dual forms and more clear nail tips and so yeah y'all very happy with my super scoop um that is going to be the last one for me i think i'm all scooped out at this point you guys um i do have one more scoop that i haven't unboxed yet i got it weeks ago and um i've just kind of been sitting on it i've kind of been sitting on a lot of these scoops um just because i wanted to kind of give myself a break in between opening them up because i was getting quite a few um and the nice thing about it too is is um these scoops have been like my little guilty pleasure lately um been going through a stressful time and so it's just been something for me to look forward to um opening up and receiving and just being surprised with all the goodies that i got so i've also been waiting to open them for when i'm kind of feeling a little down and out and need a little pick me up right so this was one of those moments and so I'm really happy with everything that I got and I'm excited to put all these items to use. As you all can already see on my channel, I've been using my Eno Couture products that I've gotten in my scoops and I'm super excited to use them even more. I really want to get into doing a video showing you guys how to do the nail foils because um, I, I feel like a lot of people are curious about how to put those to use and how to use them properly. Um, but yeah, stay on the lookout. I do have one more scoop and it's just a singles $20 scoop that I have. Um, I got it months ago before he did this most recent round of scoops so I'm not exactly sure what in it but i'll get it unboxed for you guys here on camera and that will be my final scoop you guys no more scooping for me i've enjoyed everything i got i'm very grateful for everything i got i have plenty of you know couture products uh pretty much to last me a lifetime but his products are, are absolutely amazing high quality um 
and just really good stuff. So very happy um, that I participated in these scoops and I'm looking forward to unboxing my last final scoop. And I've just been enjoying watching you guys and seeing what you've gotten in your most recent scoops. Looks like he has more acrylics and things like that that he's including in his scoops. More practice hands, mechanical practice hands, things like that. So um, the rest of you guys who are just getting into it or who are continuing to do their scoops, enjoy y'all scooping. Happy scooping to y'all. Um, but I'm done. <laughs> And I mean that, uh, like I said, I got one more scoop that I already purchased. It's in here right next to me. I'll get that unboxed here whenever I have the time to do it. But yeah, I'm loving everything that I got. Happy I participated. And it's just been a really fun time. And I've also met some really amazing people through doing these scoops. I felt like I've met a whole new um, crowd of uh, nail friends, nail sisters through scooping. So it's, it's just been a great experience overall. So um, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Let me know what your favorite item was. Um, I love everything that I got. Honestly, I love everything. I'm happy and um, I'm excited to just put everything to use. And again, I do have a dedicated playlist for all of my Eno Couture scoops. I'll leave it down in the description box below. And if you guys are curious about this nail set that I have on, I do have a full tutorial here on my channel. These are my BT Art Box X Coat Tip Press On Nails. I absolutely love them, you guys. Um, so I'll leave this tutorial link down in the description box below as well. But I love these nails. They're super, super cute. But yeah, I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. If you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around. Join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below. And I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Y'all, she could not wait to say bye. All right, y'all. Have a good one. <laughs> bye. Bye. <laughs> Mommy.